Certified Financial Planner courses are the educational classes that you take that prepare you to take the CFP exam. They can be taken live and in person. Uh, they can be taken uh, via the computer. You can get the books and do correspondence. There's a number of ways of taking these classes. And um, it's just a matter of, of working through uh, the materials just like you would uh, do with any other uh, college level course. The subjects are a wide range of issues that pertain to, uh, of course, this subject matter, which would be how to set up a budget for a household, how to set up uh, your cash flow situation, how to monitor your cash flow situation, how to uh, help people with their investing uh, ideas, uh, educating them, uh, how to analyze a mutual fund, stock reports, uh, how to take complex financial paradigms that exist in families and sort through those things and come up with suggestions as to a course of action for people. Uh, and uh, all of this is very, very good information uh, in the raw. Uh, in the real world, uh, what you find out is that it is unfortunately uh, not as valuable as you might hope because people don't simply tip their hat and say, oh, well, anything you say, sir, we're going to get it right and go ahead and do it. It's like saying to someone, well, I've taken courses on how to golf. It doesn't mean I'm any good at it. Uh, you put me and Tiger Woods on the same golf course, you're going to get two different results. The reality is that Tiger learned it from his dad. And so, Someone says, well, does it mean anything that someone's taken these classes? Well, sure it does. Does it mean that I'd be more likely to get uh, what I want from them than somebody that hasn't taken the classes? Perhaps. I don't know what the statistics are.